Pues sí, es que yo creo que... Good evening, Mr. Beltran. Good evening, dear teacher. How are you? I'm fine. What about you? I'm chilling. How was your your day? Busy. Busy, but good. Okay. The same as usual. Yeah, as usually. The same old story. Yeah. But today is Friday, you know, and everybody knows. Yeah, we are feeling super happy after working the whole week, yeah. the entire week. But tomorrow I have to work. Oh, so sorry. The, but you have to the work? Half, yeah, oh, I have to work. The half day. Half shift. Chi oh. Half shift. Yes, yeah, my chat. Yeah, very good. Roxana, nice to see you again, Roxana. We're missing you, Roxana. Maybe Good morning, teacher. 
Good evening, Roxana. Happy to see you here again. Okay. Good evening, Mr. Guillermo. Good evening, Sandra. Mr. Guzman. Good evening, teacher. Good evening. Good evening. Good evening. Okay, wait for a minute then. Okay, okay, okay. Wait for a minute and we are going to start. We're going to wait for your classmates. Wait. Okay, 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 okay. Wait just for a minute. Wait for some of your co-workers and we are going to start with the class of today. Remember that today is Friday. So and the body knows. Uh, maybe Mr. Beltran, um, so Mr. Beltran, yeah. Mr. Beltran has to work and some of you maybe have, have to work on half chief. But maybe, maybe they are some lucky men or lucky girl that they don't have to work tomorrow. Wait. Okay, time's up. Five minutes past of seven. I mean, five minutes past seven. It's time to start with the class, okay? Welcome again to another day in the paradise. Today is Friday and the body knows. Welcome to our class number eight. So it means that today you have to finish your homework number eight. Okay, Miss Rivas Duran, we are gonna take into account. Okay, so we are going to study about might and might. So that's the topic of today, how to use it. And we are here in 
Programa Nacional Inglés para el Trabajo, given by Inglés Corporativo, sponsored by Insafor. Ok. So, let me see what do we have to start. We have to give again like a review of the topic. What was the topic of yesterday? Mm -hmm. Do you remember How the to, topic? Uh, we was uh, making sentence with the model verb can and could. Excellent. That was our that was our topic yesterday. Wait, wait. We were. It was. It was. We were making. I said. Uh, we was. <laughs> we were making. Sorry. Don't worry. Something happened today. Let me see. Okay. Okay. So let's gonna start again. It's like a. It's a religious. I mean, uh, it's like a religious. Okay, let's gonna start, let's gonna see. We have to remember when we use could and when we use can, okay, or can't. Right now I'm gonna share to you. Okay. Okay, number one, I know how to speak English and German. I can't can or could mm -hmm. letter b letter b i can <laughs> oh mr roberto yes <laughs> it's i can speak two languages because remember that can is for present and is for abilities okay present abilities okay number two can he swim? Can. Letter A. Yes, he can. Yeah. This is also how we can see the answer. Like, remember that a com that short answer, they are yes, he can. Uh, yes, he can. So, that's why. Okay. Letter so number three, I don't know where to park my car. Mm -hmm. Permítanme, tengo un problema ahorita, permítanme. Hello, Mr. Guzman. Hello, Robertillo. What do you think about this question? What do you think is the correct answer? Okay, Excellent, so, Mr. Uh, Beltran is taking my place. So sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Very good, I Mr. Beltran. Uh, yes. <laughs> Excellent. You are going to be I the next so, facilitator so, of English yeah. Corporativo. Very well, Mr. Beltran. I like it. Uh -huh. Let her see. Letter C. Why letter C, Mr. Guzman? But yes, because remember because when you do a question, a question, you have the info question. question and after the modal verb and after the subject and after the verb. Where can I park my car? Okay, very good. Thank you, Mr. Beltran, to su for supply me. Very good. <laughs> Number four. Mm -hmm. Number four. Help. 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 Yes. In this case, remember, why is help? B. Letter B. Why? Mm -hmm. Because I love you. Because when you have the modal verb can, 
the next verb has to be in simple present. Can the teacher help me? Uh, number five. Mm -hmm. Letter A. Letter A. Read the whole sentence then, Mr. Guzman. Because it's a possibility. Ah, yeah. Read the sentence then. A possibility. No, but read the whole sentence. Lea toda la oración. Read the whole sentence. He couldn't run very fast last year, but now he can. Excellent. Because couldn't is for the past. Yes. We say that yesterday, no? Yes, it's letter C. No, it's letter A, she, he says. Because the first one is past when he says he couldn't run very fast last year. It means that he couldn't do last year, but right now he can. That's why it's letter A. Hmm. Letter A. Number six, uh huh. Letter C. Letter C. Letter B. Letter B. Letter B. Letter A. No, I mean, no, no, letter, letter C, sorry, letter C, yeah. So, sorry, Mr. Beltran, yes, I was watching. Okay, read the whole sentence, Mr. Beltran. Do you think they can cook well? My answer, yes, I do. Yeah. I think so they can. You think that they can cook very well. Okay, thank you. Number seven. Letter A. Letter A. Letter A. Letter B. Letter B. Okay, who says letter B? Who says letter B? Who was? Thank you. Who is me? <laughs> Who is me? Say, tell me your name. Consuelo. Ah, okay. Read the whole sentence, Consuelo, please, because that's the, the answer. Letter B. Can you remember everything our English teacher said yesterday? Yeah, can you remember? That's it. Can you remember everything our English teacher said yesterday? Okay, that's why. Can you remember? Because it can it not cannot be letter A because it's could in this case. And remember is an ability. Okay, that's why it's letter B. Can you remember? Thank you, Consuelo. Okay, letter A, number eight. Sorry. Letter C. Letter C. Letter A, letter C. Who says letter C? Roberto Guzman again. Yes? Yes, Mr. Roberto Guzman? Um. No, it's okay. Read the whole sentence. Uh -huh. It's let again. Why can I read on time? He is late again. Why can he arrive on time? Mm -hmm. Why can't he arrive on time? Okay. Oh my God. Letter no, no, number nine. Sorry. Mm -hmm. Number nine.
Mm -hmm. Letter A. Letter A. C. C. A. Who says C? Letter A. My God. It's letter C. It's my letter God C. is the winner. Yeah, my yeah. God. It's letter C. My God, can, yeah, you, can you read the, the sentence, please? The whole sentence, my God. Where can I find some information about traveling in Europe? Where can I find? Where can I find some information about traveling in Europe? Okay. That's okay. Let's go now. Go for the next one. Number ten. Oh, sorry. Number ten. Uh, letter. Letter A. I was late for class last Thursday because I couldn't start my car. Let me see. Let's gonna check. Letter ten. Letter A. Excellent. I was late. Letter A. I was late for class last Thursday because I couldn't start my car. Very good, Mister Beltran. Number eleven. Mm -hmm. The first one. A. Letter B. Letter B. Letter A says. Letter B. Letter A. Bertrand says yeah. it's letter A. Why? Because each is the. You remember when you do this kind of sentences, the main verb, like in this case, teach has to be in the way, cannot be teachers, cannot be teaching. That's why it can be teach. But if it would be in another case, we can we make a question using could, mister? In what, how is again, sorry? Uh, in my, uh, let's imagine we are trying to make a sentence using could. Yeah, but maybe we can, I can need we someone use, to yeah. teach my yoga class. No, ah, well, I couldn't teach. I couldn't teach my class of yoga yesterday. Yeah, that's it. I couldn't teach because that is. But yeah, I, I think I want. I was wondering if you make the sentence, you get rid the letter is from the verb teach. It would be right, but I. I that's what I think. I don't know what you think. Yeah, because teach is the verb. As that, but it's only in the letter B. I'm talking about letter B. Ah, no, you can use imagine. because you cannot use yeah, the, the verb. Yeah, in this way you cannot use. Yeah, Maybe. but let's imagine mm -hmm. that we can get rid the letter S of the verb teach. Yes, uh huh. Yes, it does. It that work if we if. We can make a sentence yes, or equation. But no, in this context. Yes, we can do it. Last okay. I, last I was telling you, when I say I could I couldn't, as my example, I could not teach my yoga class yesterday. In that case, I okay, Mr. Could. thank you. I could not teach. But in this case, it's, I can teach. Read the whole sentence, please. I need someone to teach my yoga class tomorrow. Can you teach my class? Excellent. Number 12. Mm-hmm. Letter C. Letter C. Letter C. Number 12. I'm sorry. No, I it's letter A in this case. Yeah. Why? Mr. Diego Ruano, welcome. Could you read then the whole sentence? Oh. You were, no? 
Yes, yes, I'm very sorry, but I don't think I can help you. Yes, because it has the negative in this case. That's why it cannot be, I mean, exists like a rule in English that you can use a double negation. That's why you cannot be, don't think I can't, because you have don't, and after you have to, I mean, let me see. As by example, you have don't, you cannot use again a negative. That's why it cannot be can't. That's why it has to be can. I'm so I'm very sorry, but I don't think I can. No creo que pueda ayudar. That's why. Okay. okay. Because you cannot use can because you have done again. So that's it, guys. That was the review of yesterday's class. So sorry. Like four words, four, 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 four questions are missing, but don't worry. So let's gonna go for the attendance list. Oh my God. The attendance list. Attendance list. Today is Friday. Today is Friday, September. So today is Friday, September. Eight. Okay. Oh well, it's okay. I'm here. Let me see. Yeah. Friday, September eight. Okay, Ana Consuelo Amaya. Present teacher. Excellent. Ana Maria Rivas. Present teacher. Good. Eh, Brenda Angélica Díaz. Present teacher. Karen Beatriz Castillo Sensente. Present. David Armando Romero Hernández. Present okay, teacher. Excellent. Diego Armando Rodol Romero, perdón, eh, Diego Rodolfo Ruano Vázquez, sorry. Present, present teacher. Thank you. Fatima Laura Mejía Meléndez. Present teacher. Gabriela Margarita Vázquez Lemus. Present teacher. Guillermo José Osorio Ventura. Present teacher. José Roberto Ramírez Beltrán. Present teacher. Catherine Guadalupe García Chachagua. Present teacher. Thank you, Monica Liliana Ocotán Barahona. Roberto Antonio Guzmán Rodríguez. Present. Uh -huh. <clears throat> Roxana Elizabeth Ramírez Lima. Present, teacher. Excellent. Ruth Margot Benítez Díaz. Present, teacher. Okay. Eh, Sandra Yamilet Alvarado Aguilar Present teacher Walter Manuel Reyes Campos Present teacher Excellent, okay mm -hmm. So let me see I'm going to start We are going to see our questions Maybe we are not going to have too much time But I think so that we are going to have A little time to answer just you can give me a word for these questions. I mean, okay. Let me see. What is it? Ah, okay. So the question is, how was the last purchase you did? Okay, Sandra. Um, let's gonna start to ask the question to Margot and after in that way, okay? And you can write down wrong, bad, good, excellent. I mean, you can answer that. that, okay? Sandra to Ruth Margot, ask her. Hello, Sandra. Problems with the audio, Sandra. We didn't listen to you anything. Again, camera off, wait. Okay, Sandra, can you listen to me? Can you hear me? 
wait wait uh, how, okay. how was the last last purchase you did uh -huh, Ruth Margot how was the last purchase you did um, buy a pair of shoes ah but how was the last I mean Cómo fue? How was that? Good, excellent. I mean, mm -hmm. in one word, bad, e good, excellent, nice, ah, huh? excellent, excellent, uh, excellent, new yes. steel, yes, excellent. Now, Margot to Walter Reyes. How was the last purchase you did? Last purchase. Purchase you did well. Uh -huh, Excellent. Excellent. Also, very good. Walter to Robert Beltran. How was the last purchase you did? I it was. Let me think. It was an excellent purchase. Again, excellent. Good. Robert Beltran to Catherine Guadalupe Garcia Chachawa. Garcia Chachawa, how was the last purchase you did? Okay. My last purchase was very good. I bought some wired. Oh, very good. You bought so what? Wired wallet. Ah, <laughs> wallet. Wallet. Ah. ah, wallet. Yeah. Very good. Catherine Guadalupe to Karen Castillo. Okay, Karen. How was the last purchase you did? Karen is busy, maybe. I ah, know. Um, good. Good. Excellent. Karen to Roberto Guzman. How was the last portrait you, do, you did? Ro Robert, me dijo. Yeah, Robert Guzman. Robert Guzman. Uh, it was so so. It was so so. So so. Yeah. Excellent. Okay, to Ana Consuelo, please, Roberto. Okay. How was the last two times you did? What? Usually. Usualmente. Ah, usually. But in this case, you have to express an adjective that it's a good, bad, sad. I mean, I don't know. You have to express that. Not usually. Oh. I mean, an expression like bad, wrong. Uh, I mean, I don't know. Mm hmm Good. good, excellent. Very good, Consuelo. Consuelo to Guillermo Josué. I don't know if he's there. Yeah. How was the last process you did? Guillermo? My, my last process is very, very good. Very good, excellent, Guillermo. Guillermo to Roxana Ramirez. How was the last purchase you did, Roxana Ramirez? Uh, this, uh, good. Good, excellent. Good. Roxana to Fatima Laura. Fatima, how was the last purchase you did? Very good. Very good, excellent. Uh, Fatima to Gabriela Vasquez. 
Gabi, how was the last project you did? My project is very good. Very good, excellent. I don't know, Gabriela to Brenda. Brenda, how was the last process you did? I don't know if Brenda is our. It's good. What was? I was, it was good. Good, excellent. Brenda to David Armando. How was the last portion you did, uh, David Armando? Hello, Brenda. Hello. Good. Good. So, good, yeah. excellent. David Armando to Diego Ruano. How last push you did, Diego Ruano? How was the last purchase you did? Mm, I don't remember my last purchase. Push uh, mm, well, I think it's a it was a t-shirt. It's a good experience. It's a, a good a good purchase. Good experience, I like good experience. Yeah. Very good. Mr. Ruano to Roberto Beltran, that I think that he is starting. Okay. Hey Roberto, uh, how was the last purchase you did? Okay, it was bad. <laughs> <laughs> okay, bad. So that's okay. These are the words, guys, that you share about the experiences that you have about buying something okay let me see we are I'm gonna let i mean i don't know ana maria i didn't ask you because you told me that you have problems with the internet do you still have problems ana maria no ya no ah, okay. ya se resolvió ah excellent <laughs> ana maria how was the last purchase you did ana maria my last purchase was very good. Very good. Now uh, uh, you can ask to me, Ana Maria. Okay. Teacher, mm -hmm. how was the last purchase you did? The last purchase I did, what it was? Maybe, maybe it was a coffee. It was a nice experience. I remember it was on Sunday. I, was, I think it was a nice experience, yeah. Or a soda. <laughs> I don't remember the last purchase I did. <laughs> okay, good. Thank you. I'm going to stop sharing and we are going to see the, the, next, the next work in our manual, okay? We're going to see. Let me see. So sorry. Ah, okay, read the information about the question, okay? So you are gonna be sending to the groups right now and you are going to uh, complete this exercise, guys. Uh, on page 23, you are gonna work in section two and three. Read a survey about a customer experience with a product. I mean, you are gonna read this and after you are gonna read the information again and you are gonna answer the question and you are going to compare with a partner if you think that it was good, no. Okay, you got it? And even if you get bored, you can ask the questions to your classmates, okay? Yeah, I get it. Excellent. If no, I'm gonna to start to do my voices. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. Yes, teacher. I understand, yes, teacher. Entendí. Yes, teacher. <laughs> Repeat, please. <laughs> Come on. Okay, Mr. Good. Really? Do you need to I, do I have to repeat Mr. Guzman? Really? Okay. No, no, no. I don't know. I mean, you have to read this survey and you have to answer this inform to answer these questions about the survey. Okay? Okay. Okay, you are there.
Hola. Hello, Fatima. Hello. ¿Qué número de página es, chicos? 23. 23. Okay. Thank you. Product is. Rate mm, your opinion about the product's quality. Very low quality. Will you continue using this product? No. Okay, read the information again to answer the questions. Compare with a partner. Okay, we only got three questions here. I think it's gonna be easier. How was the custom customer's experience? ¿Cómo fue la experiencia del cliente? Mm, fue mala porque aquí dice que todo fue y no se sentía satisfecho fue de baja calidad y dice que no quiere usar el servicio otra vez ni el producto y el valor es muy pobre, muy, no sé si es muy aquí en este caso no sé qué significa déjame decirte por. Ajá, por, entiendo la palabra correctamente pero eh, porque me dice que es pobre eh, very poor very poor, good, excellent it, was, it would be good if it says it was cheap or it was expensive. <laughs> the teacher is here. I think he can, gave, he can give us an example. Oh. What, what does it mean, the number three, the value of this product is? Value. Value. Yeah, it's the price. Is the price okay, yeah. but also the value the... Is, is related to the price, but it's also, I mean, uh, I mean, the quality, I mean, of the product. I mean, that is like a, imagine that you are going to buy a car like a BMW for a good price. Oh, wow. ah, that's why, that's why you have wow. the. Value. I mean, you are going to pay for that car because you, you say, oh, it's a BMW. But imagine that they are selling to you a car very expensive. And it's, a, and you know, that is, imagine that is Tayara. <laughs> hmm. You say, what wow. is Tayara? Or as by example, I don't know if you know the, the, the brands of car, Tata. Tata. Tata <laughs> is a brand of car. I never, I never heard it. Ah, yeah, but it exists. But imagine that's why. Tata, wow, it's a new brand for me. Yeah, but you can, you can, you can make a research in it. Exist Tata cards. <laughs> okay. 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 Así de pronuncia. Which one? Satisfied. 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 Satisfied, yeah. You have to listen to the song. Satisfaction. <laughs> when I cry, when I cry, when I cry. Satisfaction. Yeah. It's because you have. Yeah, Miss Catherine is here again. Come on, Catherine. Yo me imagino al teacher escuchando música cada rato. Oh my God, no, Catherine. Y bailando. Ah, come yes. on. El solo ahí. No, come on. Because <laughs> I know a lot of music. Education. <laughs> education. Uh, music for education. That is. Yeah. <laughs> you know, you mm. Education, Mark. <laughs> yeah, we don't need. No sonido, education, Mark. Another brick in the <laughs> Yeah, because yeah. almost, almost, I have almost a, a a song for every word. Almost, not for all of them, but I have almost. Almost. Yeah, almost. <laughs> Casi. <laughs> yeah. Yes. Yeah, almost. Okay. I I have almost one song per each word. 
Subtítulos, teacher, subtítulos. Subtitles. Tengo casi una canción para cada palabra. Mm, a ver, oh. quiero ver. ¿Qué le, ¿Qué le digo para ver si es cierto? Try me, try me, try me. Like the girl. Beautiful girl. Ah. Girl, I told you yesterday. Beautiful oh. girl. Purple. Purple. Beautiful girl. Ah, yeah. Beautiful. Uh, beautiful, beautiful girl. Yeah. Hey, did you happen to see the most beautiful girl in the world? <laughs> and if you did, it was she crying, crying. <laughs> hey, that's it. <laughs> no, para lo escuchado. Hey, come on, that's a mm -hmm. that's a famous song. No, you can look. Yo creo que en otra vida fue compositor. <laughs> I woke up this morning, realized what I have done. Yeah, I have almost, 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 not for all of them, but almost I have a song for each word. Otra, each word. otra. Oh, come on. Cante la de because. La de? Because. Ah, because I love, love you. Love. Exactly. Oh, why? The <laughs> other one, why? Why am I supposed to live without you? <laughs> yeah. Come on, me gusta una que, que dice Dalion, algo así, Dalion. I don't know. Gente de león. Ah, uh, oh, uh, well, what is the lion? In the, ah, in the ah, jungle, sí, the quiet bonita. jungle, the lion sleeps tonight. In the jungle, the quiet jungle, the lion sleeps tonight. <laughs> Could be that. Okay, I'm going to move on. Las canciones de inglés. Huh? Lo que me decepciona es que no puedo pronunciarla. But you have to listen then. Igual que yo. You have to listen then in the way that you listen. Maybe you are going to you you are going to pronounce them very well. So oh, yes, you have to listen. Yo las ando descargadas casi, así con, con, con las letras de inglés, pero me cuesta. You start night in white satin. <laughs> oh, she lights the wind through my dreams. She rides the night next to me. She leads me to moonlight. Hold it on what is done. <laughs> Yeah, I can break it from myself. Nobody comes to me. Pero bien puede, yo canto y... <laughs> Just like Invoca a un, a un demonio. <laughs> oh God, be careful. <laughs> El demonio viéndome mientras yo canto en inglés. Oh my God. Oh God, God, God. Que le está ofreciendo el alma. <laughs> Repent, girls, repent. I'm gonna leave. Tú con el producto. No. Eh, ¿Qué otro problema? Pues aparte de que no funcionó, eh, aquí no tiene mucha información. Como te The digo, product porque... didn't satisfy him. Didn't satisfy the, product him. Di the product didn't satisfy him. Maybe okay. uh, it was not the product that he asked. Maybe. Very, okay. That's oh, a good one. I mean, he, he felt that the product was. Uh, but was was cheaper? I think so. Yeah, was cheaper. Yeah, was yeah, was so cheaper. Yeah, that's it.
You can put the t-shirt size. Ah, the t-shirt size. <laughs> ah. Oh, come on, you can do it. <laughs> That's why it's, you can do it, guys. Yeah, do it. they put the. the... Mm -hmm. De alguna marca, vaya, de alguna marca. Un perfume. Compré uno baratito. <laughs> Los que usan Avon. ¿Quién usa Avon? <risa> Gracias. Yo el solo, mío era más barato. Yo solo el Revlon. Revlon. <risa> yo compré una loción, pero creo que solo era agua con olor, porque. Sí, bajó la calidad de ese producto. La Avon. verdad. Yo usé en un oh, tiempo. Avon, Avon. Las lociones ya no vienen igual. Así okay. que oh, okay. piensa en posibles no problemas. Se viene el agua otra vez. Cualquier producto puede ser. Sí. sí. Siento que un, un problema que pudo haber tenido el cliente de que así como cuando muestran la foto para que se ven grandes, <ríe> cuando le llegó, diferente. <ríe> ah, sí es cierto. It's not according to description. Uh -huh. Puede ser un problema. Es cierto, porque a mí ya me pasó. <ríe> Yo le compré una cocinita a la niña y yo decía, va a ser más grande que ella decía, su nombre es chiquitita ay no, lo estafan a uno cabal y si lo vio digamos puede que haya ido dañado o cosas así ajá a veces en el envío se, se arruinan es cierto, es cierto. Pueden seguir viendo el libro. Eh, sí. Entonces, ¿cómo le ponemos? Vamos a hacer trampa. Ojo, Roberto, ya. <risa> Vamos a usar el traductor. Yo mm, puse una, dice, the product may have been, ay, no sé cómo se dice dañado, damage. 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 Yeah. Okay. Thank you. Okay, <clears throat> I think so that you didn't finish, but we are going to continue right now, and maybe after I will send it to you the maybe the answers of that one. Okay, right now, let me see if I can share. I need to explain to you this: the use of my of my and might, different my and might. Okay, my is mostly used for present tense. My, might is mostly used for past perfect tense. Okay, listen, 
past perfect tense and this is used for present tense. When you say it's mostly used, that's it's almost always, but not always. May express a high possibility. Might express a lower possibility. My used to ask for and give a permission. Uh, might use to ask for permission. And we have an example. Of course, she may join us for dinner. She might have called, but I'm not sure. Okay. So it expressed that the possibility is too, too high when you say she may join us. I mean, it's almost 100%. But in this case, I'm, I'm not pretty sure about. So again, we can see the difference. My, my versus might. The key difference between my and might is that may, or well, may, sorry, is the present form of might form. And might is the past form of may. So may is used in many different situations to give permission, to ask for permission, to talk about a possible situation in the present or the future, to express wish or hope, to refer to a thing that typically happens in a certain situation. And might, that it, the first one is may, I wanna be sure, but it's may, okay? It's may, and the other one is might. It's may. May. Exactly, may. May. May, 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 may. And the other one is might. 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 May and might. Might is the past tense of may. To ask for permission, to refer to something that could have been in the past, to talk about a hypothetical or remotely pos possible situation. And you have here examples. As by example, we have, oh, sorry, what's up here? That's it. Okay. Example with may, you may go home now, John. That's an example of the first situation to give permission. May I come in? Please do. That's for number two. If you park your car here, the police may tow it away. Okay, that's an example of three to express, I mean, to talk about a possible situation in the present or in the future. May you, may you be blessed with a lot more candles to blow out. <laughs> Four. That is a, to express a wish or a hope in a false move may lose the game. That is of, X, the, of, 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 of situation number five. That is for may and might. Might, he might get there in time, but I can be sure. Past tense. Okay, this is past. He might get there in time, but I can be sure. Might I bring you a cup of tea? That is a as per permission. Might I might I bring you a no, sorry? She might have been killed if the neighbor hadn't intervened. So this is to refer to something that could have been in the past. She might have been killed if the neighbors hadn't intervened. Inter intervened, yeah, intervened, intervene, inter inter intervened, yeah, intervene, yeah, intervened, intervened, yeah. If you flatter your mother a bit, she might invite us all to dinner. That is to talk about a hypothetical. Maybe your mother can accept. I mean, if you flatter. What means I don't remember. I know flat like a like an apartment, but flat is comparative. Uh huh. That is financial. I mean, horizontal apartment. Yeah, but it's 
additional translation. So sorry, we are with our services. Uh huh, flat, chato, I know that it's flat, bemol, gal, fijo. How you can use it? Flat means plano, llano, true, buena, true, sin cambio. Oh, what well, is that? Desinflado, agotado, horizontal, apartamento, pinchadura. I mean, smooth, send it. So, so, was categoricamente chato, mate, no reflecting. I mean, if you flatter, I mean, I'm gonna read because maybe it could be a same. So, but these are the ways to, I mean, these are the ways to use my, may, sorry, and might. May, might, may, might. Okay. So, do you have question with this, guys? Uh huh. Hello, do you have a question with this? Uh, I don't I don't have any questions. Okay, thank you. Or let me know, Mr. Beltran. Okay. No. No, no, you don't. Uh... You don't, I mean, it's a kind of feel like a good coffee. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's a kind of feel like a good orchara. Okay, let me explain what we are going to do. So right now then we are going to uh, display the exercise number five. Okay, you are going to go to the breakout rooms, but let me see. So you are going to do exercise number five. That is my name, my create sentences using words provided and or might write a compliment with okay. What will be here? He may be he may be not satisfied, or he might. What will be? That's why that you can write. He may be not satisfied, or he he might. Be not satisfied. Okay, that's what you are going to write down. <laughs> and I uh, mean, uh, the warranty may be longer or might be longer. That's what you have to write down, okay? Okay, you are going to be sending to the groups. Hello, teacher. Hello. Uh, the app get out the application again. Oh, okay. The application method. Okay, I'm gonna be with you again. Okay. So let me see. So the the app get out. So ah, it's because maybe you were, but right now you are assigned. So right now you are there, Mister Guzman. Oh, he not. He not me be satisfied. No. Excuse me. Uh, uh, could you repeat? He, he me. And the first and the no, first sentence. No, he, he not me be satis satisfied. Satisfied. Yes. 
Jack. Yes. Also Jack. Ella no podría estar. No. Sí. Mickey is, is, está en paz. Entonces, vamos a ver, May. Yes, uh, okay, depends the, the past sentence. Because this present is May. Mm -hmm. And in this past, it is might. In Colby, Colby Bob. Pod, mm, podrían ser ambas, ¿no? Teacher, the use maybe no. Acting uh, microphone. Yeah. Yeah, could be. Uh, uh, let me see. Yeah, could be like. Uh, may not be. Car, sorry. Uh, may not be. Or maybe. May not. Might. Might. might I mean, may. May could be, might not be, uh huh, might not be, yeah, or might Maybe. not. Do you so might be no? Might be, might, might, uh -huh, might, no, that's, uh, I mean, that's why I don't know, uh, no, in this case, no, that's why I didn't write might, might, might be not, I said, could be, might not be. That is. Might not be. Oh, Might not be. Exactly. Might not be. Be longer. The Hi, Mister. Hi. We get confused uh -huh. using these types of model verbs. No, but it's okay. Uh, you are good right now. He may not. He may not be satisfied. Uh huh. He might. He he might. He might. No, he, yeah, he might. Sorry, he might not be satisfied. The warranty may be longer. Yeah. The service <laughs> might not be excellent. Uh -huh. ¿Eh? Esto de esto como de yo siento esta número tres como que sería como eh, no sé. Uh, pues yo pondría might. Ma might. Uh -huh. Yeah, I think that's almost. I mean, uh huh. Might not reach. Might not. 
en el país. Ajá, imagínate. Would you write down, commit the mistakes? No. You want to be right, I mean, it's, it's very good to commit mistakes. Yes. Just, just it depends on the mistake that you commit. No, but it doesn't matter. Wow. <laughs> yeah, that's true. This service might be excellent. Está bien escrito así, va, Robert. Ah, but it's, right. there is my not. Remember, yeah, that's my not. It's my not be for my limit. Oh, my not. Yes. Service may not be excellent. En la otra, pienso que puede ser como una. Ni suponer, eh, bueno. Todas son my. Good way to solve it, Catherine. ¿Cómo dijo? Buena forma de resolverlo. Cuando vamos al Team Marín. Eso iba a decir. A la que le toque tres, esa va a ser la. La primera opción. Ay, no. Cara corona. Ay, cabal. Cara corona. <risa> sí, May, no, no, está haciendo así la, la tarea. May, en la cuatro. Le puse y May. Y no, ya. Yeah. In English is any mini mini any mini mini mo. El team marín no. Yeah. <laughs> That's in any mini any mini mini mo. No, mejor en español. <laughs> yeah, it's any mini mini mo. Teacher. Hi. ¿Cuál es la diferencia entre my y may? My may is present. Might is past. May express a high possibility. Might a low possibility. Might be. Yeah, might. That's a difference. Might, difference. Is, might is el que dice May, de como mayo. No, ese es May. Este es May. Exactly. And the other one is mm -hmm. Might. Yo al revés lo pronunciaba. <laughs> That's why you have to say ini, mini, 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 mo. <laughs> ini, mini, mini, mo. It's like, ah, you learn, you see, you learn in English. Instead of saying, what is the doping way? Ini, mini, mini, mo. Mm -hmm. Gradúeme ya. Excellent. <laughs> okay, thank you, teacher. You're welcome, Catherine. Uh -huh. The service may, may not be excellent. Uh -huh.
Teacher. Hi. Um, the same screenshot the the image the example the may mix. If I can send you in an a screenshot. Yes. By WhatsApp. Yes, please. About the explanation or about the manual? No, the the, the presentation of what you presented. Ah, okay. No, no, uh, I now understand the use of the mic and the, the, the pass on pressing on question. Okay, right now I will, I will share. Wanna see if I can do it. Because I don't see you can see it very well. Let me see if I can do it in another in another way. I'm gonna send to you, but give me time, please. Well, even I want to send to the group. It's there, mister. Just is charging right now. I mean, it's um uploading. That's why. Okay. Now. Now, I mean, let me see. Now you have to go for this. You have to <clears throat> work on exercise number six. You have to create a conversation where you are dissatisfied with a product and say what you ma may or might do about it, okay? What you may or might do about it, okay? You have to create a conversation, guy. Okay? Just as a recommendation, I don't know. <laughs> So are you clear? What are you going to do? Yes. Yes, yes, teacher. Yes, yeah, teacher. Thank you, teacher. You are the best teacher. 
Hello. Hello. Okay, you got it. What are you going to do, guys? Mm, I get it. Okay, everybody. I don't, I don't, I, I don't get angry if you use IA to create dialogues, but you have to create them. Short. You can create dialogues like I think so. Like this one, dissatisfied without a smartphone, dissatisfied without a streaming service, dissatisfied with a restaurant meal, and dissatisfied with a witness with with a fitness equipment purchase. Okay. So you have to create four dialogue. I mean, no, you have to create just one dialogue, okay? You know, according if you are dissatisfied with a product that you bought. You got it, guys. Just Roberto Beltran answer. I imagine that everybody has understood. You have to use my or mate, okay? My or mate. Okay, very good. That's <laughs> music for my ears. Me hablaste. Give me a moment, please. Okay, tell me, my friend. I want to um, share my screen. My, my. My book. Give me a moment. Okay. Can you see my screen? Yes. Yes. Okay. I don't know what page. Uh, we work. Microphone teacher. 24. You are working on page 24, I think so. No, I mean 20. Yeah, 24. Exercise number six. Okay. Create a conversation where you are dissatisfied with a product and say what you may might do about it. Okay. Hello. No hay nadie. Yes, Guillermo is here, Roxana is here, and Sandra is here. Hi. Hi, teacher. Yeah. 
tienen unas tareas que hacer también. Bueno, Sorry, ¿cómo Sally. vamos a empezar la conversación? I don't know. <ríe> piensa, piensa, piensa. <ríe> Está insatisfecho con un producto y diga que puede hacer respecto. <ríe> Llegamos a una tienda a preguntar un producto. Uh -huh. Y le empezamos a ver. Así como uh -huh. cuando vamos a comprar ropa y hoy ya vemos todos los defectos. Malo que está. The important is the use and the... The main the, the knock may make in the use of the, the, the conversation. Yes, uh, could be the the customer uh, tell to the to the seller. Sí, en silencio va a ir el pichi. Conversation. El que nos mata más. Sí. Eh, digamos, dos serían los tiendas. Why? What about the schedule? <laughs> Ah, uh -huh, about the schedule? Catherine. <laughs> mi mira. <laughs> Modo mi mira. <laughs> Gabriela Vázquez. No está. Yes. You are the winner no. of the lotto today, Gabriela. No. ¿Cómo dice? <laughs> You are the winner of the lotto. Qué bueno que ya quería dormir. <risa> Hoy se llevó la lotería. Eh, no está oh. Gabriela ahorita. <risa> Me va a llegar el tiempo y dice la conversación. Yes. No, te muero. Ya les dije, dos son los tienderos y dos son los clientes. <risa> You are the winner of the lotto, Gabriela. You have to stay with me today. Que no te estoy en clase, dije. No sé, sí. Ayer no pude, en serio, no pude. ¿Ah? Ayer no pude estar presente. Que se quede después de la clase. <laughs> yes, that's it. No. Por eso le hacía burla que tenía sueño y te va a tocar quedarse después. No sé, pero ya a las nueve me retiro. Thank no, you, ya Gaby. Le, ya le dijo, ya has dicho, ya. La loto. Clarito dice ahí el mensaje, a las nueve. <risa> Cumpliendo el de ayer. <risa> Pero él dijo que no había permisos y usted faltó ayer. Sí, fue una emergencia. Le va a tocarse quedarse otras dos horas más para reponer las de ayer. No. Mejor me conecto mañana yo solito. Ay. No, Gaby, no. just ten minutes, Gaby, just ten minutes. Es broma. Ah. No, I didn't say that. I'm kidding. No. no, no, de verdad, me tengo que quedar. Ajá, a I mí, mean, voy a hablar español un momento. Sí, a usted le corresponde hoy quedarse los 10 minutos después de la clase, Gaby. Okay. <laughs> Sorry. That's why Catherine was making fun of you. And even Consuelo. Uh, 
Hola, Eso, Consuelo. Consuelo. Good morning. Welcome to our store. How can I help you? Good. <laughs> Esto ya ha sido vendedora por eso. Ah, bueno, <laughs> that's okay. <laughs> Ahí llamando a los clientes para que entren a ver la ropa. Excellent. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Stand. It's the war. Mm, it's the complete t-shirt and, and what's the fittest ending and my call can meet <laughs> is the little difference and then yeah, there's use. a little difference. <laughs> yeah. Uh, I mean, can express possibility. May is most for permission, okay? Could express also possibility, but express the past. I mean, can is almost is the permission and possibility, but may is more polite. After could could be polite for ask something, but for ask permission is more polite may, and after might is the pass of may, and could is the pass of can. Yeah, is is I remember and the and the who's other year and the past and my usage, and my yeah, war usage of that yeah. So that is the difference. My the, boss. The, the mainly mainly point is that can is for present possibility, could is for past, may, may is for present, might is for past. Yeah, I I, I remember and the and the need need help me and the compañero un compañero de trabajo. Bueno, era mi jefe. Mira, le digo yo, pero. La que da asistencia es una gringa, vos, yo inglés nada, le digo yo, a, a rebuscarte, me dijo. Ahí está que esa frase yo la, todavía la tengo pegada, could you help me? Cuando yeah. eso le chateaba yo nomás, could you help me, please? Exactly, because it's the, it's the polite way. You can use, can you help me, but could you help me is more polite. Mm -hmm. yeah, it's complete. It's complicated. Yeah, I know that it's complicated. It's complete. Yeah. Yeah, the thing and the can, call, may, me. Right. It's all, also lo mismo. <laughs> Almost the same. <laughs> oh, it's okay. What happened here? I don't see it. Everybody's working. I mean, what's up here? Ana Maria, Sandra, and Guillermo. Are you working on there? Dialogue, guys. Hello. Hello. Okay. Okay. Huh? 
Are you working on the dialogue? Que no le entendí, dijo que se lo enviáramos por WhatsApp, dijo, ¿cómo dijo? No, 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 you have to create the dialogue here, I mean, you have to create the conversation here, maybe in your not, I don't know, where not, don't worry, yes, you can, you can create it here, but you have to be creating, and after you get bored, you can practice your dialogue, maybe you can share by WhatsApp, and you can practice your dialogues. Yes, Ana Maria. Yes, Sandra. Yes. Yes, teacher. Okay, thank you, Mr. Yo también. Por eso dice change y dice que no me parece que hay que ser me me improve. May you change the food? Sí, sí. Yeah. Mi respuesta. Eh, quiero ver, luego dice. Ok, eso. Podría. Mostrarme el. Los. Variables colores. ¿Qué quiere decir, Roberto? Los, color, los colores. Ella, ella, ella le va a, a mostrar, sí. dice ahí, los estilos, los colores. Se lo va a medir. Venga para acá. Salga, güey. ¿Quién puede tomar una captura del chat y enviármelo? Que, que me cortó y me sacó de la aplicación. No puede tomar la captura del primero. Okay. Enviamos. ¿Por dónde se la enviamos? Aquí mismo. ¿Sí? Ya lo tomé yo. Ah, porfa. Lo enviamos a, al WhatsApp. Aquí, aquí, al grupo. La página 24 dice. you please change the Looking for, a lo mejor le voy a, le voy a cambiar a party, <ríe> le voy a cambiar otra cosa. <ríe> Ay, yo así lo tengo apuntado bien. <ríe> pues, no, no me haga pecar. Ah, pero una fiesta, o sea, una fiesta ah, de bodas. De, de, una boda, no sé. ¿cómo se dice? Ajá. Boda, por... Ah. Wedding. Wedding, wedding party. Wedding party. Bye. Wedding. Wedding party. I imagine, yeah. I don't know. A wedding celebration, I don't know. What are you doing? Who is going to marry? Marry. Mm, mejor marry. Uh -huh. Who is going to marry? <laughs> Salud. 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 Bye. Y luego de, de 
okay, yo te contesto, dice Ana, lo que sigue. Uh -huh. eh, ¿Cuál es lo que usted contesta? ¿Quieres ver? Yo te digo. ¿A dónde lo vamos a enviar? O sea, yo te digo ah. los estilos, pero como tú preguntas, ajá, ah, de de la la gigante, Después de, de lo que yo digo, va lo que escribió Ana, porque ella te dice, eh, tenemos algunos estilos y así que, que tú puedes mm. ver y puedes ver cuál te gusta. Vaya. Mm. Luego tú le preguntas por la talla y luego va Robert. Robert. Uh -huh. Donde la pregunta de la familia. Pero tiene que ser insatisfecho. Ah, sí, es cierto. Y la Catherine así, ay, no like, no like the dress. Ay, no, no. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Next, next. O, o, <ríe> o, no, o tú así como, ay, no hay nadie más que me despache. Ay, no. <ríe> me voy a sentir, ah, no. Es una ¿Qué? escena de la película de Mujer Bonita cuando ella llega ahí. A pedir que la tienen y nadie la quiso entender. Ay, no. Y todas las chicas así como una mujer sin filtro. Pues. <risa> ya me imagino, muy buena escena. Yo sería una de ellas. <risa> vale, luego va Robert y luego le pongo. No like, re return the product. Yes. Pero yo no me fui tan allá, yo pensaba, digamos, si hubiera ido a comprar un pantalón. No devuelve. Lo cambio. Yeah. The chance, uh, yeah. Other, other, other season. Yeah. Other size. Other size. Ah, and you understand me. <laughs> yes, I understand. I know you what are you say. I mean I have experience. Teacher, you, you, you speak and tell me English costeño también. <laughs> <laughs> like a Spanglish. It's Spanglish. Oh like Spanglish. Uh, the, Then you the, know the, there, there is like a, a, a yoke. I don't remember the yoke, but it's the the men. Who, who, I mean, the man who was beat on the 100, un hombre que fue golpeado en la 100. 
<laughs> okay, that's why. What's up in here? Do you have finished? Yeah. You're me, Mr. Beltran. Don't worry. <laughs> we were talking about just a little bit. Okay, about disappointing or this dissatisfied with a product. Um, we we gave two examples. Oh yeah, very good. We are close to go out from the breakout room. Okay, yeah. each of we gave uh example. Excellent. Good one and uh, bad one. Excellent. Good. So just in a minute, we are going to go out for the break home rooms, okay? Bórrelo, uh bórrelo. -huh. Uh -huh. Donde esté insatisfecho con un producto y diga que puede ser. Satisfied. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. What do you do? Okay. Vaya a correr por eso. Uy, sí, no, ahora no. estamos ahí no, cortos. No puedo, estoy. ¿Cómo dice? Sí, seguro. Seguro, sí puedo, con mucho gusto. Oh, thank you. Y me quedan los 10 minutos, pues, y yo bien dormida y el piche de Gabriel, Gabriel. Hello, Ay, I'm no, here. Chamimo. Hello, I'm here. Ay. I'm here, Gaby. Ya me di cuenta. Attendance time, guys. Ana Consuelo Amaya Merino. Present teacher. Ana Maria Rivas Durán. Present teacher. Brenda Angélica Díaz de Chacón. Present teacher. Karen Beatriz Castillo Sensente. Present teacher. David Armando Romero Hernández. Present teacher. Mm -hmm. Diego Rodolfo Ruano Vázquez. Present teacher. Fátima Laura Mejía Meléndez. Present. Gabriela Margarita Vázquez Lemus. Present. Guillermo José Osorio Ventura. Present. José Roberto Ramírez Beltrán. Presente. Catherine Guadalupe García Chachagua. Present. Mónica Liliana Ocotán Barahona. Roberto Antonio Guzmán Rodríguez. Present. Roxana Elizabeth Ramirez Lima. Present teacher. Ruth 
Margot Benítez Díaz. Present. Sandra Yamilet Alvarado Aguilar. Present. Walter Manuel Reyes Campos. Present. Ok. <clears throat> so, I know that you have been working how to create a dialogue using uh, the one that I told you. I mean, that is uh, my and may. Ok. Let me see. And remember that this is also part of my and ma, may and might. I may I. And the way to do the the verb may, I mean, may plus not, I mean, plus the verb may not, may not. That is the, the way to do the verb. Let me see here. So when you see they may not, it may not. She might, they might, we might, he might not. That's the way to do uh, the negative way of uh, the negative way of these two verbs. I mean, I don't know if you have any question about this. Mr. Romero was asking me what's the difference. It's a little, little difference between can, could, may, and might. Okay, there is a little difference. Not too much, but if you practice, you can use them very well. Question, guys. No. Hmm. I sent it to you also, the answer of this sentence. Did you see on the group? Yes. Did you see the answers on the group? Yes or not? Guys, did you see the answer of this exercise on the group? No. I did it. Ah, okay, you did it. So you see, thank you. I don't know. Do you have any question about this topic? No. No. Remember, no. may is for the present and for permission. Might is for the past. I mean, might is a low possibility that something happened and may is a high possibility that something happened. Okay? In the case of can, can express present abilities and permission. Could express past ability and it's a good way, it's a polite way to ask for help, for permission, it's a polite way to order for something, okay? That's why the difference between can and could, may and might, okay? Mm -hmm. No, no questions? No questions. No questions. Let me see then. Wait, wait, wait. Ah, okay. Yeah. Wait. Let's gonna see this. Let me see if we can finish. <laughs> Okay, let me share with this just to practice a little bit. Okay, my family and I might or might, or oh, this might be, uh huh, might or might be. Might. 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 Yeah. Good. You did good. John isn't in class today. I think he... He might be. 
Might, might be. be. Yeah. Because it's a possibility. Next. At least equation. I may be or I may not be. Might not be. May not, may not, may not, may not be. May, may, no. remember, may, that is may. May, may, not, may be. not be. Excellent. May not be at work tomorrow. I would like to say that, but we have to. We may, we may have or we may be have. May. Why may. 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 Yes, because we have after may, we have verb. May have a grammar exam next week. There is no sound of coming from the radio. It might or might be. Mm. Might? Might. might okay a sound coming from the radio might it be might be might be might be, might be. are you sure might. yes i'm yeah, sure might maybe it might be because this is past i mean this is past perfect tense i mean i mean all oh, the verb is in uh -huh, the verb is in past participle Broke, break, broken. Might be correct. So oh, good, guys. You are very smart students. I may be late today or I may not late today. Second one. May. Maybe. May not. No, no. Maybe because it's maybe is the verb maybe and late is a uh what is a another that's why it cannot be okay and stop chating okay guys today is friday and the body knows and the body knows that i don't know maybe armando he has to go to, he has to go to the disco <laughs> <laughs> After the class, no. he, he is prepared to go for the disco, but he was his, he he's very responsible because he is staying in class and he comes he comes to the class. But after you can go to the party, guys. Yes, he is going to Amanda's beer. Oh, really? Yes, <laughs> yes, my friend Robert. <laughs> I mean, they, they they are Salvadorian friends. They are called Cheros. <laughs> yes. Okay, guys. No, now you can. I mean, I will see. You can close your eyes. You can close your eyes and go to the disco, students. <laughs> Do you feel the music under your feet? Do you feel okay? Instead of go to the bed. Okay, so then bye bye. Have a good night. Have a good uh, Saturday. Please do your homework so you if you haven't done. Okay, if you haven't done homework, so you can do it on this coming weekend. Please. Okay. Bye bye for everybody. Just Gabriela. I don't know if you are still awake, Gabriela, or are you sleeping? <laughs> sleeping. Right now. You are with one closed eye and with the other open. Like... <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so yeah, like a teacher, please. No, I don't want to stay, teacher. <laughs> And what eye do you have closed? This one or this one? Yeah. <laughs> ah, okay, that one. No, teacher, please, I can't. Okay, Catherine se va a quedar también. Dice. Ah, Catherine. Bye bye. 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 Interference, interference. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> Sorry, teacher, I have to go. I have an emergency. No, no ent entiendo lo que dices. <laughs> but the other one that just say, <laughs> Sorry, I'm freeze like a. Don't move. Ya I'm gonna se... believe that one. Puede no, hombre, no, no se hombre, así ni... como la gente que dice que se queda congelada porque se le va la señal. Así como que... <risa> Don't move. Yo no puedo. <risa> no, hombre, tres de carga tiene, ya se me va a pagar. Really so no. sorry, Gaby. Te compasión. <risa> 10 segundos me quedan para que se me apague el celular, dígale. Have <laughs> compassion. Ay, have sí, bye bye. Bye bye. bye, bye. Gabriela. <laughs> bye bye. Eso es con dolo. <laughs> con dolo le dice, bye Gabriela, bye, you are sí. going to stay. <laughs> Ahí nos cuenta. <laughs> bye bye. No bye bye. Sé. Bye bye. bye bye. Okay, Gavi, how can I help you, Gavi? Yeah, me too. Believe it or not, um, like I'm like a, I'm trying to open my eyes, and I'm like, a, okay, Gavi. <laughs> so, you know, Gavi, I have three words. <laughs> I have three words. This is my third word. On Friday, I am like. A, but right now I'm here. Tell me, how can I help you, Gaby? <laughs> but tomorrow you have to work. <laughs> I know that I imagine that you are on your bed like. See, <laughs> my I, I go to the work tomorrow. Okay, but you yeah. work just half shift, solo medio turno. Yeah. Okay. Oh, uh, twelve, twelve o'clock. Okay, at twelve o'clock, like. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> no, no one oh, minute black. more. No one minute more. No, just no. twelve o'clock. Hay que cumplir el horario. That's okay. It's okay. It's good. Y usted así, cuando le conviene. Yeah. <laughs> nah, don't worry, Gaby. Ajá. Uh -huh. ¿Cómo le ayudo, Gaby? Diga. <laughs> no, dejarla ir no puedo. Ok, déjeme ir. Déjeme, no, no, que está por mandar. No, no, no. No, no. Um, no sé. Me cuesta un poco. Ajá. Ajá, any topic, no sé. Algún tema. Um, no, no lo sé. <laughs> no lo sé, no sé. Cuando me preguntan así, soy como tipo, ¿y ahora qué digo? ¿Qué, qué le contesto? ¿Qué cuento? No, no sé, algún tema que le haya costado de los temas que hemos venido estudiando ahorita. O oh, no sé, ah, tips. Este... <clears throat> Eh, me gustaba el de, el de la hora, pero eso ha sido en módulo anterior. Mm. Y respecto a eso, cuando es de hacer así como preguntas, o me cuesta un poco, pero la estructura sí me la sé. Mm. Lo que me cuesta es buscar la, las palabras y, y como conjugarlas así que, que se den a interpretar bien. Ah, entonces lo que le cuesta a veces es, digamos, ya se conoce la estructura, pero saber entonces la categoría gramatical de las palabras. Ajá. Como que ajá cuál es verbo, claro. cuál es adjetivo. Ajá. ajá, entonces yo digo, si es pregunta, ah, primero va el, el, el verbo. El verbo to be, luego va el... Pero eso depende de la pregunta que se haga. Ajá, sí, también. Y está lo que, la que lleva la W, la H. Las si info la... questions. Ajá. ajá. Y así las oraciones que va el, el, el sujeto, el, el verbo to be, el del verbo y de ahí el, el complemento, así. Sí. Sí, pero a veces, lo, bueno, en ese sentido, you have to study, Gaby. I mean, 
no hay como un método así estrella que esté, ah, no, fantástico. Tienen que más o menos saber sí. cuáles son verbos. Con saber verbos sabe bastante. El problema también a veces es de saber, digamos, que una palabra puede ser verbo, pero a la vez puede ser adjetivo. Ajá, también. Entonces, y vaya, por ejemplo, tengo una parte de, de por eso ha sido una oración, y de ahí para completar lo siguiente ya también como mm -hmm. que... You have difficulties. Ajá, y yo así como... Ajá, Ajá pero... Y quizás solo leyendo, por ejemplo, algunos juegos, o en el caso, pues, eh, yendo a algún diccionario, ¿no? Por ejemplo, yo, pues, no sé, recuerdo a quién de acá, le recomendé que debería tener en su, en su, ¿qué? En su teléfono, no sé qué tanto espacio, pero, por uh -huh. ejemplo, recomiendo Word Reference. Ah, ah, bien, sí, ese ya lo, lo he escuchado y lo he usado cuando estudiaba. Pero podría descargarlo, digamos, en su cell phone, ¿no? Porque, uh -huh. porque digamos, es, eh, es uno, digamos, que es bastante... Bueno, por ejemplo, voy a ver if I can share. Se lo voy a mostrar, por ejemplo, a Camil. Y otra cosa es por lo menos entenderlo, ¿verdad? Por ejemplo, del, in, del español. Deme una palabra en español que usted quisiera saber cómo se dice en inglés. No sé. Um, no sé. No se me ocurre ninguna. Uh -huh. Este Ah, va ¿Cómo se dice, por ejemplo Tropezar? Ah uh. Ah, uh, stumble es como el verbo más común Stumble Stumble Entonces, va, por ejemplo, acá yo, digamos, igual en el celular puedo ir aquí y yo ya me paso al inglés. Stumbling. ¿Cómo se pronuncia? Creo que aquí. Stumble. Stumble. Ajá. Stumble. Y aquí estemos, tenemos las inflexiones, que es conjugate. Stumbles, tercera persona. She stumbles, he stumbles. El, el verbo en presente, en presente eh, continuo, that is stumbling el verbo en pasado stumbled y el verbo en pasado participio. Ok, stumble and you have here some, some sentences as an example. Walking along mm -hmm. the dark path, Helen stumbled and almost fell. Y aquí tiene la traducción. Entonces, at least, por lo menos esta aplicación, la puede tener en su celular, es bastante buena, digamos, para que me haga dando el contexto de las palabras y estas oraciones de cómo se usa esa palabra. Ajá, ah, sí, está bastante interesante. Uh -huh. Ya está dormida. No, 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 todavía no. Es, sí, la, la voy a descargar. A veces se me olvida bastante porque casi no uso celular, entonces no, se, me, se me va. Se me asusta. Uh -huh. Sí, la, la, la voy a descargar porque me va a ayudar bastante también. Por reference. Ya la apunté. Va. Eso por lo menos le puede ayudar. De ahí pues, no sé, en su caso siento que entiende bastante. Ay, yo digo que no. No, de que entiende, entiende, pero no lo pone en práctica en el inglés. Entiende, sí, entiendo que entiende... Y, y capta lo que digo, pero a la hora de ponerlo en el inglés, ahí se me va. Ahí ya, ya. Desapareció la Gabriela por un momento. Y yes. así. Sí, es cierto, me cuesta bastante. Le, le cuesta expresarse a... en inglés. Sí, tiene la, de las destrezas pasivas de oír y entender. I mean, you can listen. It's okay. But when you have to express in English, it's like a, you are a kind mm -hmm. of child. Es un poco tímida a la hora de decir me voy a equivocar y por eso no hablo, entonces mejor empieza a hablar español. Sí, ¿verdad? Sí, puede ser, puede ser. Así es. Mm. es entonces, you have to lose, I mean, tiene que perder ese miedo. Uh -huh. 
por lo menos aquí en la clase debe de tratar de hablar más inglés. Yo sé cuando los mandan los grupos todos se, se emocionan en español. Ya hoy ya yo no hablo español por lo menos en la clase central. Mm -hmm. Pero ya yo en los sé. grupos todos se emocionan y vuelven al español y ahí se sienten <risa> cómodos. Y... A, ver, a veces me pierdo así con lo que hice yo. Bueno, ¿qué? ¿Cómo? <risa> a veces les digo yo a los chicos en, en la sala, miren, este, así, por ejemplo, si es alguna opción, o, eh, les digo, ah, de, de question number three o cosas así, que uno más o menos va, va entendiendo poco a poco. Ajá, y así. Sí, pero sí tiene razón en eso, ¿no? Sí, me evito hablar. <laughs> That's it. Okay, Gaby, I don't know if I can help you in another stuff. In if no, you are free. Si no, ya es libre. Yeah. <laughs> you are free. <laughs> you are free to go to your bed. Yes. Yes. Mi tiempo de resto. Sleep. Ya no, no se durmió, aguantó. Uh -huh. Aguanté, resistí, soy una guerrera. Yes. Ay, no. No, lo meto es estar, estar al día. Ok, Gaby. Okay, no, so then, bye bye. See you on Monday. Good night. Good night. Ya me salgo, me va a sacar. <ríe> Usted me dice, yo ya tomo, después tengo que cerrar normalmente, no se preocupe. Ah, no, cierre. cierre. <ríe> ok, bye. Bye, teacher. <ríe>